Welcome to Explain, a series of health education programs published by the Patient Education Institute, the leading provider of interactive health education. This video includes general medical information and does not replace the medical advice of your doctor or healthcare provider. If you have questions pertaining to your medical condition, ask your doctor or healthcare provider. Premature Ovarian Failure, POF Introduction Premature ovarian failure is also called POF. POF is when a woman's ovaries stop working before she is 40. POF used to be called premature menopause, but it is not the same as menopause. Some women with POF still have periods every so often. This is not true with menopause. This program will help you understand premature ovarian failure. It talks about symptoms and causes of POF. It also covers diagnosis and treatment options. The Female Reproductive System The female reproductive organs are in the pelvis. They are located between the urinary bladder and the rectum. The female reproductive organs include the ovaries, the fallopian tubes, the uterus, the cervix, the vagina. The ovaries have two main roles. 1. Making special hormones such as estrogen and progesterone. 2. Ovulation, which is the release of eggs that are needed for reproduction. Every 28 days, one of the ovaries releases an egg. The egg goes down to the uterus through a fallopian tube. It may become fertilized on its way. The uterus is pear-shaped. It is about 3 inches long and it has 3 layers. The inner layer of the uterus is called the endometrium. A period happens if the egg is not fertilized. During a period, the egg and inner lining of the uterus are shed. The lining and egg leave the body through the vagina. This cycle repeats itself every 28 days. Symptoms The first symptom of POF is often a change in a woman's periods. Periods may be skipped. They may also become irregular. Some women with POF also have other symptoms. These are like symptoms of natural menopause, such as decreased interest in sex or pain during sex, vaginal dryness, hot flashes, irritability, poor concentration, night sweats. Another common symptom of POF is infertility. Infertility is a term doctors use if a woman is unable to get pregnant. It is also used if a woman is unable to stay pregnant. Some of these symptoms are similar to other diseases. They may not be caused by POF. Talk to your healthcare provider so he or she can find out the cause of your symptoms. Sponsored by the Patient Education Institute. www.patient-education.com Over 5,000 videos and interactive tutorials. Complications POF puts women at risk for other health problems. Some of these may happen in the long term, but they are serious. This section talks about some common problems faced by women with POF. Osteoporosis is one common problem caused by POF. Osteoporosis is loss of bone strength and density. It causes bones to become weak. Women with POF can reduce their risk by getting enough calcium and vitamin D, performing weight-bearing physical activity. Women with POF are also at higher risk of low thyroid function. This can affect how your body works. It can cause very low energy levels as well. Replacing the thyroid hormone can help treat the problem. Some women with POF experience anxiety and depression due to hormonal changes. Medications and counseling may help. Dry eye syndrome and eye surface disease can happen as a result of POF. They can cause discomfort, blurred vision, and permanent eye damage. Treating these conditions can help prevent damage to the eyes. Having POF also raises the risk of getting heart disease. This risk can be reduced by exercising regularly, getting hormone replacement therapy, keeping a healthy body weight, not smoking, Causes 
Doctors do not know what causes POF for sure, but they do have some ideas as to what may cause it. It is likely a combination of different factors. Ovaries have many follicles that start out as very tiny seeds. These seeds grow into eggs. Most women have enough follicles to last until menopause, but this may not be the case in women with POF. Women with POF may fall into one of two groups. Follicle depletion. Follicle dysfunction. A woman with follicle depletion has no follicles left in her ovaries. There is no way for the body to make more. Some possible causes of follicle depletion include certain cancer treatments such as chemotherapy or radiation therapy, damaged or missing X chromosome. A woman with follicle dysfunction still has enough follicles, but they do not work normally. Right now, there is no treatment to make them start working again. Some possible causes of follicle dysfunction are a low number of follicles, which causes problems with ovulation, the body mistakenly attacking its own developing follicles. Some women with either type of POF also have a family history of the condition. This could mean it is inherited or passed on from parent to child, but other factors are also thought to be at play. Sometimes toxins such as pesticides, chemicals, and cigarette smoke contribute to POF. Diagnosis Your healthcare provider will first ask about your symptoms. He or she will also perform a physical exam. Your healthcare provider may do a pregnancy test if you have missed a period. Your healthcare provider will also ask about your family's medical history as well as your own. Genetic testing may be done to look for fragile X syndrome or other problems with the genes. A blood test will be done if your healthcare provider thinks you may have POF. The blood test can check whether the levels of certain hormones are too high or low. Treatment There is no treatment to make a woman's ovaries work like normal again, but there are treatments that can help with some of the symptoms of POF. Hormone replacement therapy is also called HRT. HRT gives women the hormones their bodies are not making. It can help women have regular periods. It can also lower the risk for bone problems caused by POF. HRT is usually a combination of estrogen and other hormones. It can be taken as a pill. It can also be taken by wearing a patch on the skin. Many healthcare providers suggest using the patch for women with POF. The patch offers a continuous flow of hormones. This is how the ovaries would normally work. Often, HRT is continued until a woman is 50. This is a normal age for menopause. After this point, the risks of HRT increase. HRT can raise your risk of breast cancer, heart disease, and stroke. Talk to your healthcare provider to learn more about your options for HRT. There are also treatments to help a woman with POF become pregnant. But some women with POF can become pregnant without treatments. Talk to your healthcare provider about your options if you want to have a child. If you like this video, please like and share. For similar videos, subscribe to our channel. Summary Premature ovarian failure is also called POF. POF is when a woman's ovaries stop working before she is 40. Missed periods are usually the first sign of POF. Later symptoms may be like those of natural menopause. POF used to be called premature menopause, but it is not the same as menopause. Some women with POF still have periods every so often. Premature menopause is when periods completely stop before age 40. There is no treatment that will make the ovaries work normally again, but many healthcare providers suggest taking hormones until age 50. Most women with POF cannot get pregnant naturally. Fertility treatments can help women interested in having children. Thank you for using Explain.